In this video, I'll be showing you how to provide NetSuite access to someone who doesn't currently have access to your NetSuite account. The first thing to know is that um, whoever is doing this work, whoever is providing the access, uh, will typically need the administrator role assigned to them. Um, and you can tell if you look at um, you've got my name, Jacob Turnus, and then I've got the account that I'm in, Demo Anchor Group, and then my role is administrator. Okay, in order to provide access, we'll be providing access to an employee. So we'll begin by creating an employee record. So we go to lists, employees, employees, new. If the employee record already exists, um, we can instead just go find that employee record, um, but we're going to assume that they don't have one yet. Okay. You notice there might be different employee forms. I'm just gonna use the standard form here. And I'm going to say this is um, Robert Jones. Um, and you may need to pick up subsidiary that, that, that is primary for that employee. And then the important thing here is they need to have an email address. So we'll say Robert Jones at company.com, whatever it might happen to be. And then we'll go down to access. Sometimes the access tab is within the system information tab, so you might need to poke around a little bit. Click give access, and then find whatever role you want to assign to them. Um, if you want to give them also administrator access, which is the, the fullest access that there is in NetSuite, um, then you can just give them administrator. Other, most of your employees should not have administrator. They should have a more specific role like um, engineer or developer or project manager, etc. cetera. Um, and then uh, if they don't yet have access to um, NetSuite in any account, which would be normal for most of your employees, um, if you're providing access to a consultant, a NetSuite consultant, probably they already have access to a number of NetSuite instances. Um, anyways, if they don't yet have access to a NetSuite instance, or if you're not sure, just click this send new access notification email, which will send them an email and um, give them a chance to set up a password if they don't have one yet. Um, and then just click save. So to recap, we have employee name, employee email, give access, and roll. Those are the most important ones. And then click send new access notification email if it's their first time getting access to NetSuite.